Yeah. Happy Valentine's Day, T-Wolves. It's Monday, February 14, 2022. I'm Tiandra. And I'm Elijah. The Wolf View begins now. White no baby! Tools, if you have pictures of you and your friends dressed up for Halloween or any of our Winter Spirit Days, we want them for the yearbook. And seniors, if you know your plans after high school, whether it's college, the military, or going directly into a career, we want pictures of those as well. And now it's time for Tuesday's Black History Minute. Let's check it out. All right. Seth McClark lived by the motto, literacy means liberation, and was called the mother of the movement by Martin Luther King Jr. She was born in Charleston, 1898. She believed that education was the pathway to gaining freedom. She became a teacher and helped to integrate Charleston County Schools. When she remained a member of the NAACP, September was fired and became an activist, fighting for voting and civil rights. For the remainder of her life, she dedicated herself to helping educate African Americans. She started workshops that taught people how to read and write, along with teaching them to be voters and activists. Rosa Parks even attended one of these workshops. Although not accepted by the majority of men in the civil rights movement, Martin Luther King saw her as a pioneer and even invited her to the Nobel Peace Prize ceremony <laughs> in Sweden. She received a Living Legacy Award from Jimmy Carter in appreciation of her work to bring about racial equality. Setima Clark, South Carolinian, educator, activist, and the mother of the civil rights movement. That's the Wolf You for today. Have a great day and, and go, go T-Wolves! <laughs>